Oh my gosh. Oh, go, 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 go. Well, hello there, Maplers. Welcome to the Hapo Maple Show and welcome back to Nightmare of Decay. Alrighty. So I know exactly what we're going to do today. We got this bloody sack that we got in the last episode and we're going to take it to the dumb way to lift, which I believe is up here. And we need to figure out... Okay, I know there are zombies here, so we need to be very careful. We do read... Oh, can you hear them? Yeah, 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 they're here. So, we need to see what is actually in the lift. Oh, there's a lot of them. Okay, alright. Um, Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna try something risky. Go, 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 go. Put it in. Yes! Woohoo! Okay. The pla oh my gosh! Okay, that was bad. The platform that was stuck in the shaft's been dislodged and has fallen to the bottom. Great, 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 great. Oh, I forgot they're all in here. Okay, um... Okay, I think I'm gonna do what I did. Yeah, okay, I got an idea. I'm gonna group them. Okay, come on you guys, come on! Smell the meat! Smell the bacon! Oh yeah, I'm just taking my shotgun in case they get too close. Because what I have noticed is that when they grab you, I don't know if that takes health already, but when they munch you, that takes health. So, by the time they grab me, I can probably just get them off me. I do wait, hold on, hold on. I want to test something. I got dynamite. Okay, uh, okay, I got it, I got it. Hold less mouse button before releasing to charge up the amount of throwing force. Cancel a throw by right clicking. Okay, okay. Now they split up now. I need to get them together. Careful. Is anybody else here? Come on, you! Oh, oh, I made a bad. Oh, I made a bad mistake. Oh, I made a bad mistake. Okay, okay. Oh, I, I, oh, I made a bad decision. I made a bad decision. Okay, and go, do it. Whoop. Uh oh, bra, bra, bra. Go, 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 go. Ow! Damn it! Oh, that was that was a waste of a good dynamite. That was my first time throwing it, so I didn't know how it was going to be thrown. Uh, I'm going to use a health drink because I got quite a bit of those. I hate it when I'm not at full health. It is the pantry key. Nice. Okay. The platform has been dislodged. Yes. Okay. So now we can get this guy out of here if he's even still alive. <laughs> the key to the door should be somewhere in the manor. It's a large blue key with the word pantry carved onto it. Yes, yes, you said that last time. Okay, um, okay, pantry key. Here we go. Should we do this, though? We don't know him. <laughs> ah, you found the key. Hurry and open the door. My collection is running away as we speak. Dude, I don't give a crap about your collection. I just want to know if you have goodies behind this door. <laughs> Finally, I can get back to work on adding fresh toys to my precious collection. Oh. My. Gosh. You open the door, and what greets you is the ghastly sight of mutilated bodies impaled on stakes. The pungent stench of rotten flesh bursts from the now open doorway and assaults your nose. Mysteriously, the key has disappeared, and there is no sign of the person that was locked inside the room. What? Oh my gosh. Okay, so that is creepy because. Okay, so the key has disappeared. It really is like a nightmare. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is disturbing. Oh my goodness, that is disturbing. One of them is going to come to life. Oh, hell no. There's got to be something in here that I can use. Oh! And this chest is locked. The word pantry has been carved onto the lock. I don't have the pantry key anymore. I don't have, I don't have the pantry key. A young woman has been impaled on a wooden stake. Her expression is eerily peaceful despite the gruesome manner of her death. She is clutching a coin in her hand. Take it. Oh my gosh. Uh-uh. Okay, I don't like this anymore. You pry the coin from her dead hands. A moment later, the anguished crying of a woman echoes throughout the pantry and a cold chill runs up your spine as you, as you sense a malicious presence in the center of the room. Oh no, I don't want to look. Uh-oh. What? What? Oh my gosh! Oh! Go, 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 go! I'm out! I'm out! Bye! 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 Oh, frick! Dude! Oh, okay, that scared the crap out of me. So, we're gonna put the coin in there. There we go. Is that it? Uh, there are 
a number of coin-shaped indents above the fireplace. An old farmer, tired of hard day labor, falls asleep under the shade of a tree while his lawyer dog watches over him. Under the shade of a tree. Do I move these? I move these around. Okay. Okay. I have to put them in the right spot. I'll put the coin there. I'll put the old man there and I'll put the tree up here. Boom! Aha! Perfect. Yes! Thank you! We got the clap key! Nice. So, okay, now we do know which doors has the club key. Okay, that's the spade key. That's fine. The club key, we still need to explore the courtyard. Okay, 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 okay. The club key is on the second floor. Yes, there's two doors that has the club key on it. I don't know any other door that has a club key. Impaled body. Yes, we got the uh, coin from there. So that's fine. Um, mixing station. Okay, so let's go. Shall we go see what's in the? No, you know, let's go to the to the. Let's go to the second floor. Um, no, actually, no. Hold on, I'm not gonna go that way. Hell no. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. What's behind those doors? Wait, hold on. So I'm over here. There's one over there. I'm gonna go here since there's less uh zombies. Oh frick me, man. Okay, die. Okay, got him. Got him. Go go go. Okay. All right, let's go through here. Here we go. Unlocked with clap key. Okay, okay, we can use the pistol for these guys. Boom. Oh! Okay, I missed. Okay. What? Oh, he was still moving. I was like, what? Come on. Die! Thank you. And. Bra bra okay, he's dead. Always good to make sure. Okay, what, is, uh, what does this room have for me? Okay, we got some pool sticks. Okay, we got is there literally nothing here. Oh, there is stuff here. Clock key. Oh, okay, that's for the clock. Okay, okay, cool, cool. Oh, okay. Oh, oh wow. Okay, that this is a good puzzle. I think that's a good puzzle because I already know what it is. Two pool cues are positioned in a way that resemble clock hands. One cue is pointing towards a two, while another cue broken off pointing towards an eight. So it's obviously 10 past 8 at least okay so there is nothing I can do there there's the clock okay uh, let's kill him let's kill this one ah uh, that was a waste there we go okay okay go get quickly go get quickly okay uh, where's the key clock key boom nice whoop oh my gosh I scared myself okay maybe we should kill them okay come on closer Boom. There we go. I'm gonna use my pistol for this guy. Bra, 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 bra. Come on. There we go. And yeah. All right. You don't want to take up too much shotgun ammo because this is gonna be very handy for the bosses. Assuming that. Okay, I can't actually say assuming that there will be bosses because we actually did already discover one. It's an old grandfather clock. The face covering has been opened and the hands can now be moved. A to D, oh sorry, A and D to move the minute hand, W, S to move the hour hand. Okay, so we know with the hour hand it's going to be there, and we know here it's going to be two. Boom! Look at us! Smart! Oh my gosh, we got the spade key already! Nice, I didn't even know the spade key was there. Okay, we're we moving really fast through... Um... Uh... uh excuse me? I haven't seen you in any Resident Evil game. Okay, now I'm scared. I'm actually scared. I don't like that thing at all. Okay, read notes. Lord William has been acting unusual as of late. He's been spending all his time in the basement and Lady Irma has fallen into a deep depression over his strange behavior. It all seems to have started after he asked me and a few other servants to install a wardrobe over a large hole in the basement. In the weeks afterwards, it's almost like he has become a different person, aloof and quick to anger. Lord William has ordered us to meet him in the basement again tomorrow night. I wonder what strange task he'll have us do this time. Preaching in hall, talk. Oh, I don't like- Oh, there's three faces looking at me. There's a fleshy growth on the wall with a large hole in the center. A creature with glowing red eyes is peering out the hole. Oh my gosh, it speaks. One of the heads- Okay, no, they're actually all moving. Hello, stranger. Would you mind doing a favor for me? Do a favor for the creature in the hole. Um, uh, okay. I'm not gonna judge your appearance because you're probably gonna give me something nice. Sure. 
Oh. Jeez. Thank you, stranger. I tried asking others, but they would only scream and run away the moment I greeted them. How rude. You see, I am an avid collector of human heads. The tortured expression of death on their faces filled me with great joy. Um, I don't think you should be telling another human about this. I don't think that's a good idea. But my collection is flawed. I've recently realized that something is missing. All of the heads in my collection are male, and I have no female heads. I wish to correct this imbalance. If you can bring me three f female human heads and place them on the tray I provide, I will reward you for your troubles. Okay. Offering tray. Offerings to the creature in the hole can be placed on this tray. At least it's a nice creature. You know, it won't kill me. Yes. Thank you, shotgun ammo. Nice. So we need three human heads. Female human heads. Okay, well, I already know where I can get one. We, okay, red, record book first. Record book. Uh, over here. There we go. And we're gonna go to do the spade key. So I think this is the room? Yes. Okay, and uh, unlocks with spade key. I don't think there's another... Uh-oh. Whoa! Bra! 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 Uh oh. Okay. Oh, he's getting close. Okay. There we go. Run past. I did it. I did. Oh no. Oh no. He's getting close too. He's getting close. Okay. Shotgun. Sh shotgun time. Ready? Come on. And. Oh yeah. Oh, I love the shotgun so much. Okay. Let's break this. Oh yeah. Nice. And we got shotgun ammo. This game is actually really good on providing just the right amount of ammo. So that it doesn't become too stressful. Whoops, I just opened the door without even... That is okay. Here we go. Amnesia again. It's a wall made out of a strange fleshy growth. Maybe I can solve it with something. So we do have one of the chemicals. Um, where are we? We don't want to venture on too far. Okay, this is probably a room that's going to be like a small room. Whoa. What? Uh, excuse me? Hexagon shaped hole. It's a tiny mechanism with a hexagon shaped hole. That's the crown! Okay. What's this? Dark spot. There's a dark discoloration here on the ground indicating that something used to sit in this spot. Square shaped hole. Okay, so we need a hexagon shaped hole. <sighs> Whoa. Oh, wait, what? Wait, how do I. How would I get him to go there? Wait, unless. Can I only. Okay, I think I messed it up. I don't know. Okay, okay. You know what? We can't really do much here anyways because we need a square-shaped object and we need a hexagon-shaped object. Okay, so we'll remember this room. What I do like on the map is that it shows key item spots, which is very, very handy. I like it when really well laid out maps do that. That picture scares me. So does that one. Okay, we've got a big door over here. Whoa. Whoa! What? Oh no! Oh my! No, you are kidding me! Don't tell me we have Ganados in this game. Oh my God! Wait, the sh what? The shoot? What? Oh crap! They're out to do. Oh crap! Okay, 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 okay. Crap! They shoot. They shoot. They shoot. Oh crap! Okay. Whoa! Frick! You're kidding me! We have Gonados! And they- Oh crap! Ow! Okay, okay, I got him, I got him. Oh crap! Okay, okay, okay. Careful, careful, don't die. Got you. Oh, headshot! Yeah! I play Call of Duty, fool. Oh, and they gave me ammo. Nice. So we have a library, what seems to be the case. Jeez, okay. So... Hmm, interesting. Wait, okay, let's go down here first. There's got to be something in one of these bookshelves that will help us, right? No? Okay. Oh, we got a chest. Oh, frick! Oh my gosh! Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh, you son of a frick! Drink! Drink again! No! Drink again! Drink again! Drink again! Wait, and run! 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 Ow! Crap! Run! Run! Oh, oh, it's fast! Destroy it! Oh, you suck! Oh, I hated that. Oh, I did not like that. What? What is this? Lockpick. Thank you. Oh, that... Okay, that got me. 
Okay, health drink. Okay, I'm using up a lot of health drinks now. Oh, I did not like that. Wait, so I got a lockpick? Um, can be used to... Lockpicks are quite flimsy. I don't really know. Does this game show me where I have locks? I mean, uh, sorry, not locks. Chests? I don't actually quite know. What's this? No, that's the old clock. Uh, I know there's a chest. No, do we use that chest there? Okay, you know what? We'll just keep it until we come across a chest because, to be honest, I can't remember where all the chests are. Let's check the second level. Let's check the second level. Uh, can we go through here? Yes, we can. Okay, we got more here. Uh, more to... Oh, okay, there's more rooms. Okay, and that leads over there. Okay, I'm not gonna go to there. I'm not gonna go there yet. Okay, because that, that's basically a way around. We've got so much blood over here. That's not good. I wonder if there's gonna be zombie dogs in this game. Uh, the zombie dogs were very, very popular. I, st I have a feeling one of these books are like... Okay, there's nothing else here. Okay. So, interesting. Okay, I think I noticed that when there are no enemies around, you have unlimited sprints, which is uh, quite helpful. Because then you can get through levels a bit faster. Um, interesting. Okay, so... Oh, oh, crap! Crap, 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 crap! Oh, that was so close. Oh, that was so close. Okay, so... I wonder if I should check all of these rooms, like, right now. I think I should. Shape of a diamond. Okay, what's in here? Do we have a record book? Give me that. The decapitated body of a middle-aged woman lays sprawled on top of the bed. A trail of blood is leading from the body to a wardrobe. Oh. My gosh. <gasps> what? Dude. What? Okay. Oh my gosh. We got the jar. Okay, that does. We got the second one. We just need one more. We got a notes, attitude documents, and to read. What has happened to my husband? It's almost like William has completely. Oh, has become a completely different person. Now he even spends his nights down in the basements, and I can't remember the last time we slept in the same bed together. We barely speak to each other anymore. Even more worrying. Some servants have gone missing and strange things have been happening around the manor. Just last night I heard a horrid breathing sound coming from the wardrobe. It kept me up all night. Oh no, it's gonna make me look in the wardrobe. I tried to tell William about it, but he just ignored me and walked away. I'm beginning to fear for my life. I can't live like this anymore. Oh crap. Okay, let's open this wardrobe first. Okay, cool, cool. Oh, game, don't make me... Whoa. That's a creepy painting. Don't make me do this game. It's gonna be a jump scare. I just know it. Go! Go! Oh, thank goodness. I'll need to find the key to unlock it. Oh, you know what? I don't want to find the key. Okay, do I even have a key? No. Spade key. I don't think... It doesn't say what type of key I need. Bloody wardrobe. Okay, uh... Lockpick, maybe? There's nothing... Oh, sorry. Lockpick? I think it can be used this way. I need to find the key to unlock it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Aha! And we made it back to the courtyard. So we do have quite a few number of rooms to explore up there. And then we... Sorry, did I just say courtyard? I'm in foyer, my bad. And then there's the courtyard over there. So we're gonna save... There we go. Boom. I'm going to go ahead and leave this video here. So... Even more exploring has been done. We discovered a library and also we kind of encountered our first boss, which is pretty darn terrifying. Uh, we didn't manage to kill it because I ran out of there like a wimp. Because uh, I realized he moved kind of fast and looked really, really creepy. We also um, came across a bunch of new items. We now have a... Where is my inventory? We have a club key and a spade key. And, uh, yeah, and we, I don't know if this game is the type that will say, like, we don't have any use for it anymore, or whatever the case is, maybe it will, but there's a lot that we need to do in, well, there's, there's the other, what do you call it, um, uh, what do you call it, the chemical that is in that library over there, and we have two doors that we need to explore up there, and we also have the courtyard, so there's a lot to do still. But I'm having such a blast playing this game. I cannot believe this game was for the price it was. 
such a worthy buy and I can't wait to just see what else is in store for this game. This is such a great game, very very well made. I'm having such a blast playing it so far. With that being said, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button to become a Mapler today. Check out my check out my Discord server called the Mapler Zone. Lots of fun going on in there. Link is in the description below. Comment on what you want me to play next and I'll check it out. As usual, I'll see you Maplers in the next spooky video. However, if you do want to see... What? However, if you do want to stick around, you may certainly do so by clicking one of the two videos that will appear right now.